Her mysterious smile has captivated art lovers for 500 years, but now an expert claims to have revealed a secret hidden underneath Leonard da Vinci's famous masterpiece. Pascal Cot, a French engineer who has analyzed the painting, says he has discovered another portrait beneath the existing painting by using a technique called reflective light technology. He claims it shows an earlier image of a sitter looking to one side, which may be the original portrait of Lisa del Giocondo, who also known as Lisa Gerardini, the woman who is thought to be the model for the Mona Lisa. But not everyone is convinced and the Louvre Museum, where the priceless painting is on public display, has declined to comment on the claims. As well as the mystery of the Mona Lisa's identity, there are theories that da Vinci painted more than one version and there are conflicting dates about when the painting was commissioned and finished. A new documentary called Secrets of the Mona Lisa, which will air at 9 p.m. on BBC on December 9, is aiming to shed light on some of these mysteries using new research and technology. Da Vinci is believed to have worked on the painting between 1503 and 1517 and for centuries, it has been believed the woman with the enigmatic smile is Lisa del Giocondo, the wife of a Florentine silk merchant. Who was the Mona Lisa? Florentine noblewoman, Lisa Gerardini, also known as Lisa del Giocondo, is widely believed to be the model for Leonardo da Vinci's painting. Lisa del Giocondo is thought to have posed for the painting between 1503 and 1506. Not much is known about her life. Born in Florence and married in her teens to a cloth and silk merchant who later became a local official, she was mother to five children. It is believed Francesco del Giocondo commissioned the portrait to celebrate either his wife's pregnancy or the purchase of a house around 1502 and 1503. After his death, Gerardini became a nun. She died in 1542 at the age of 63 and was said to be buried near the Sant Orsola convent's altar. In 2014 scientists conducted a DNA test on bones found at the convent which they believe belonged to Lisa del Giocondo but the results are still to be released. Mystery of Mona Lisa Smile Solved The Mona Lisa smile isn't the only enigmatic smile created by Leonardo da Vinci. Researchers examining an earlier painting by the Renaissance master claim to have unraveled the painter's secret to creating an uncatchable smile. The study reveals how La Bella Principessa, painted by da Vinci before he completed the Mona Lisa in the late 15th century, uses a clever trick to lure in the viewer. When viewed directly, the slant of the mouth is distinctly downwards, according to the research by scientists at Sheffield Hallam University and Sunderland University. As the viewer's eye wanders elsewhere to examine other features, however, the mouth appears to take an upward turn, creating a smile that can only be seen indirectly, much like the Mona Lisa's. The technique is called sfumato, and can be seen in both the Mona Lisa and La Bella Principessa. And while other artists have attempted to use the same technique, none have done so as expertly as da Vinci, the researchers claim. As the smile disappears as soon as the viewer tries to catch it, we have named this visual illusion the uncatchable smile, researchers Alessandro Soranzo and Michelle Newberry of Sheffield Hallam University wrote in a paper published in the journal Vision Research.